People who have addiction are not those people. They're very frequently us people. I graduated top 10% of my class, National Honor Society. I was heavily using the whole time. This epidemic has hit every community. That our country now has nearly a million heroin users. We're in an opioid crisis. While Ohio's governor is hoping to find a way to end the heroin Encourage problem. alternative pain we treatments. Applauded governor John Kasich's crackdown that puts limits on A really good work going on in the midst of the an The number of prescribed awesome opiates dropped 25%. Ohio just allotted another $3 million to combat this. Giving an incentive to, to innovators who want to to help fight the state's incredible opioid crisis. I've actually been in recovery for 23 years, uh, which I'm very fortunate to be in recovery. To turn this epidemic around, we need a commitment from everyone in the state. Reducing the number of uh, opiate prescriptions is huge. I think we've done a lot to support treatment. Really the next step with this, use artificial intelligence and machine learning to be able to identify upfront who may have issues with this so we are preventing it more frequently and intervening earlier when we can rather than doing this in a retrospective and responsive kind of way. But we also need to try to do things that are going to innovate and push the knowledge and the science to another phase so that we have interventions that are even more effective and we can embrace those and implement those in a timely manner to help even more individuals. Under our current administration, there is total support and unity to tackle this issue. I think there's every reason to be optimistic that we're going to be turning this around over the next several years. By continuing to do that as communities, as treatment providers, as scientists, as anyone in our state, we can and will turn this around.